okay, we're at the gas station, aren't we, Chewy? And it was, there was one dog kind of barking all night. There was a dog who was left in his room this morning by his family so they could go to the pool or the beach or whatever. And he just had the most heartbreaking howl begging them to come back. Why can't, you can totally take your dog to the beach. I don't see why you can't take your dog to the pool, except that it'd be very, very hot for your dog at the pool. It is incredibly hot, incredibly hot out here. It was rough though. Chewie was staying in guard all night. We had a weird locking system. It was the first time I've ever seen an auto lock on a door. And mom and I were very much confused about it. We saw no other place for the lock to shoot out. But then when you tried to manually lock it, that had been disengaged so that it just auto locked. So now we're getting gas and then we're gonna go get breakfast because mom tried to eat some breakfast at the hotel and she said, she started to, she said, and I quote, I'm feeling queasy, I'm feeling bad. Uh, so then mom's on the phone and she says, yeah, Brittany just did not want to eat. <laughs> she didn't want to eat it. Well, after the review that I just heard, I mean, can anyone blame me? My God. She also started feeling queasy from another restaurant, I'm not going to name. And because of the bit, and then I said, Mom, you said you were feeling queasy last night from the biscuit, or not from the biscuits, from the, from the oh, oh. meal. And she says, no, it's just they've changed the, uh, recipe on the biscuits and that has been that was so disappointing it made me ill <laughs> so we did not have a smart tv so we were trying to i was mom told me she wanted to watch some true crime and then when we started to watch true crime she told me that the stories were quote too dark for her aren't all these stories pretty dark though <laughs> um so then we sort of, watch, well, I set up the tripod so we could watch Dr. Grande in bed. Should we calm down because he's used to hearing Dr. Grande's voice at home, I think. And Oleander. now we're going on Oleander, which I always remember because of the movie White Oleander with Michelle Pfeiffer and Allison Lohman. And obviously Oleander's been a fixture in many. driving him slowly insane so, what yeah yeah you do need to turn but that's not us dude it's Appalachian State's problem he's probably looking at his phone Ugh, people not got a lot of patience yeah so he had a rough night he was just trying to guard the family the family the familia and he was staring at the door all night and What's the other thing that I was gonna share? I don't know, it was just very... Ah! Oh, Chewie just was barking at some guys and the, the guy gave him the dirtiest look and he looks mean. He's got a bandana. Oh, yeah. It, ugh. I did not like the look he gave Chewie. 
He, Chewie's just a little dog. He's just trying to protect everybody in the in the car, his loved ones, right, Chewie? And he's inside of the car. How is he gonna hurt you? How is he offending you? I don't I don't understand the thought process. Anyway, I'd rather come down here and save the money on a on a hotel and come back down here when I'm better and see the otters, which is what we came to see and they are time sensitive because they're babies and we want to see them as little babies. Little boos, right, Chewie? Um, unfortunate that they're here in the middle of the hottest part. They should, according to all the videos, I watched the Katsume, Katsume um, channel that they have baby otters that they're raising and Splash and forget the other little guy's name but they're this couple who have uh and they think they live in bali and they have two little rescue otters they're babies they've been taking care of them they're raising them and then katsume i hope i'm saying the channel right it's k-o-t-s-u-m-e-t -E they have baby otters um, and unfortunately one of those otters um, love passed away here recently so I couldn't bring myself to watch that video, so I don't know what happened, but she was precious and she was very loved and well taken care of. Uh, just a reminder that life is very fragile and you can change on a dime. Chewie's still holding, holding his attention, waiting for Grandma. Here comes Grandma! <laughs>